Oh, this is Roxy. God, she a cute little dog. Uh, Roxy's a Pomeranian. She's three years old. She's a spayed female. Very, very sweet little girl. Um, she has a little bit of uh, separation anxiety. Her owner passed away, um, and uh, but she is good with dogs and cats. So especially having a home with another dog might be nice for her. She bonded really well with another dog in her former home. Um, so uh, Roxy is right now. She's on hold for somebody, um, and you know. We'll, Hopefully she'll go home with that person, but we wanted to show Roxy just in case that didn't, you know didn't pan out, and also because she's such a sweet little girl and um, she's great. Pomeranians are wonderful little dogs; they're high energy. Um, they do need a lot of grooming, and I can feel right here. Roxy has a lot of mats in her fur, so it's something you really have to keep up with. This ongoing grooming with them; um, their undercoat could quickly knot up and mat up. Um, so, if you're interested in, in a lot of grooming and doing that type of brushing with dogs, a Pomeranian might be a nice little dog for you. Hi, sweetie. Would you like to be picked up? Come on up here. Um, I wanted to talk a little bit about some upcoming events. Um, we are headed into event season here at the Animal Rescue League of New Hampshire, and literally there's going to be one after another events throughout the fall and into December. So our first event coming up, hi cutie, um, is going to be at Bentley Commons in Bedford. It's on Hawthorne, Dr the Hawthorne Drive. Excuse me. It's going to be on Thursday, August 20th. Um, from 2 to 4 o'clock, they're actually having a dog show there, and they've um, called it uh, Bark in the Park, I think was their name for it. Uh, but they're, they're looking for people to enter their dogs into the dog show. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, anyone who wants to go and watch, it's free to go and watch. You can bring the kids. It's a great thing to do while you know, school's out and you're looking for activities with the kids. If you want to bring your own dog, um, they're going to have all different types of categories, like even Wildest Dog is one of them. So every dog um, can do some type of trick um, and for the dog show and all that money is going to go to the Animal Rescue League of New Hampshire so if you're interested in that you can always give me a call at 472-5714 and I can give you some more information about that. Um, we also have a seminar coming up um, by a woman named Dr. Holly Rucco. Um, she is she works at um, Advanced Allergy Treatment Centers of New England, and she's going to be doing a free seminar on Thursday, August 27th, from 7 to 8 p.m. Um, the seminar is about. Uh, allergies in humans and what you can do to stop these allergies. They have a, a advanced way to uh, treat allergies that you know has nothing to do with drugs or you know medications or um, any invasive invasive type surgeries or anything like that. It's really neat and it's very interesting and it's definitely worth the shot to come here and and check it out. It's a free seminar, like I said, from seven to eight. If you're interested in attending, just give me a call four seven two five seven one four. Or you can always email me, robin at rescueleague.org, and just let me know how many people are going to be coming. Um, and then our biggest event that is coming up, a uh, huge, huge event, um, is going to be on Saturday, September 19th. It is going to be our sixth annual Pet Step. So you have to, have to, have to go. If you have a dog, even if you don't have a dog and you just want to bring the family, it's a lot of fun. It's a great day for families, for kids, um, for the dogs. The dogs just absolutely love it. And it's a fundraiser for the Animal Rescue League. Um, what you do is it's going to be held from 9.30 to 2.30 at the 4-H Center in New Boston. It's a new place this year. 4-H Center in New Boston um, is where it's going to be held. It's off for Route 13. And um, if you don't raise pledges ahead of time, there's going to be a $10 fee at the door, and kids under five are free. Um, but there's going to be food from uh, T-Bones will be there. Um, there's going to be uh, demos. All Dogs Gym will be there. The Canine Police and Milford Canine Police will be there. We'll have animal communicators. We'll have all kinds of vendors, probably 40 plus vendors, selling all types of stuff for cats, dogs, you know, everything we have. Um, someone doing Reiki on animals, we're going to have face painting for kids, we have games for kids, games for dogs. It's just such a great day and the event is held rain or shine. So once again that's Saturday, September 19th at the Hillsborough County 4-H Center in New Boston from 9.30 to 2.30. The walk actually starts at 11 so um, registration is from 9.30 to 11. And I hope you see, uh, to see you there. We're really excited about the event this year and the new location. So if you have any questions whatsoever, if you want to form a team, give me a call, 472-5714, or email me, robin at rescueleague.org.